more missions than usual were flown today, but the total number was still pathetically few. Only a fraction of the number when the U.S. Air Force was here. There are many reasons. One is that the Vietnamese have not been able to maintain their planes adequately. When the United States left South Vietnam, it gave the Saigon government the third largest air force in the world as a sort of going away present. But for an ace plane, this. Virtually the entire helicopter force at Bien Hoa, the largest in South Vietnam, sitting idly on the ground. Not going into combat, not even trying to evacuate some of the million or more refugees trapped helplessly along the coast. This of the country are now under the control of the communists. It has been a defeat of historic and tragic proportions for the government to this point. Whether or not uh, a line can be stabilized north of Saigon to permit the areas around Saigon and in the Delta to continue is something that remains to be seen. We should have a testing of that in the next uh, four weeks or possibly less.